Do you like dandelions? They seem to just pop up overnight, don't they? Some of them were there on my lawn one morning. But I know I didn't plant them there, so how did they get there? My name is Laura. Today, I'm going to talk to you about pollination and seed dispersal. All living things have a need to reproduce. That means that they need to make copies of themselves. So, dandelions make other dandelions, so that, even when one of them dies, dandelions, as a species, survive. Flowers like dandelions make copies of themselves by creating seeds, which are later planted somewhere else. To make seeds, a flower needs to be pollinated first. Pollination means that pollen from one flower is carried to another flower. Pollen is a yellow or orange powder that flowers make. For pollination to work, pollen needs to be carried over from a male flower to a female one. Did you know that flowers can be male or female? The female flower can be far away from the male flower. So how can pollen be carried to the female plant? Carrying the pollen is the job of insects, such as bees and butterflies. Bees and butterflies are very important. Without them, flowers would not get pollinated. Flowers wouldn't be able to make copies of themselves, and their species would eventually die. But how do bees and butterflies carry pollen? Do they put it in small backpacks, that they carry on their backs? No. Bees and butterflies visit flowers to drink their nectar, which is a sweet, nutritious liquid. When a bee or a butterfly lands on a male flower, it walks around it to get to the nectar. While it walks around the flower, pollen gets caught on its legs and wings. When the bee or butterfly flies off to the next flower to find more nectar, they take that pollen with them. If the next flower they land on is a female flower, the flower gets pollinated, and it starts making seeds. Have you seen dandelion flowers that have turned into seeds? This is what they look like. On a windy day, or if a kid like yourself blows on them, dandelions let go of these seeds and let them get carried off to another place. The seeds land on the ground, and, if the soil is good, they start growing into new dandelion flowers. Pollination is a big part of the amazing process, by which plants make copies of themselves. Without bees and butterflies to carry the pollen to the female flowers, pollination wouldn't be possible. No seeds would be created, and no new plants would grow. We humans need plants, so that we have food to eat. So, next time you see a bee or a butterfly, Think about what an important job they have.